Hey guys, welcome to the pre-show. Yeah, I decided to do this. Just decided to do it. I, I had my lunch and I said, hey, I'm having lunch at one in the morning. I should really stream a show because I'm wide awake and I have work to do, but I also wanted to keep on... If, if I stay on this schedule, this nightly schedule that I've gotten on by accident, I'm not going to be able to keep streaming these video games lonesome, and I want to get further in Skyrim, so I'm going to stream for about three to four hours tonight, I think, just get and get it back into the main quest and uh, see what we do. I'm seeing a real slowness in the chat to the reaction to going live and the reaction to seeing me, so could you guys ping yourselves and see what kind of a, what kind of a delay there is? It seems like it might be longer than it usually is. <coughs> well, the pings came pretty quick there. Now, how many Mississippi did it take to see your messages, guys? Three seconds? Oh, okay, so maybe it's just me. I'm, I'm crazy then. Um, so, I'm going to move my mic a little bit. It's going to hit my chin if I keep it here. Seems to be a bit of weird green screen stuff going on, on my one shoulder there. This is what happens whenever we wear gray stuff. I think I'm going to change shirt and I'm going to change socks because you guys always complain about how they're dirty. So I'm going to change into dark socks, I think. But I'll be back soon. And I don't sound like a robot. That's all I need to know. Um, so, <coughs> I have a bit of a cold still. It seems that the cough is coming back again. I don't know why, but... Uh, um, stay tuned, we'll be right back in about uh, five minutes. Welcome to Video Games Lonesome, everybody. Thanks for joining me in the middle of the morning to play some Skyrim. Just two days after Christmas and the first time that I jumped into Skyrim alone, which was on Christmas Day, ten hours of playing, about eight hours of footage with all the breaks cut out. Uh, that has just been uploaded to YouTube and it'll be available in the morning once I'm done this show. I'm going to start putting it out. Uh, I don't speak French. What are you talking about, guys? Why would you ask that? Just suddenly. Um, how you doing, chat room? How you doing, Europe? I know this is about uh, 10 in the morning for you right now, so I'm hoping that by streaming at this time of day, I'm going to get more people that don't usually get to see the show to see the show. Uh, let's get into the game there. How you doing, guys? Great. I'm still lonely. <laughs> 4 a.m. in Alabama. So we do have some night owls joining us as well, not just Europeans. Uh, Australians too? Yeah, I keep forgetting about Australians. What time is it for Australia? I forget the time difference. Is it like... It's like a 15-hour time difference, isn't it? So it would be like... About 3 p.m. for you? 11 a.m. over here. Breakfast coding and VGA at the same time. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm, I've destroyed somebody's lives who were just about to go to bed. 7 or 9 p.m. in Australia. Jeez, that's a long, a big time difference. Or are you guys before us? No, you're, you're ahead of us. So, jeez, that's, that's a huge time difference. That's like 12, that's, that's like 19 hours ahead of us. That's insane. Poor Australia. Alright, let's uh, play. But that means that in Australia, when we go live at 3 p.m., you get to see us at something like 8 in the morning. See, as long as you're early risers, you get to always watch the show. Uh, I, I gotta stop babbling. Let's play some Skyrim. Continue with my last save game? No. I think that I, I played a little bit alone to do some testing. Uh, no. Low. Whoa! Nova King, 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 King! Nova King! Man, they know how to get you pumped, eh? I think this one's the one. Sleep is for the week. Pasfruta! <coughs> Pardon me. Dynamic compression! From now on, I shouldn't do dynamic compression. I should just uh, do Fusro Da and see how that works out. Am I lonely? Fwaswer? Fwaswer? Dovakin. Dovakin. Derpa derp. Dovakin. Dovakin. 
fuss rohoda sleep is indeed for the week that's when how you get strong it's two in the morning but i got up at 9 p.m so this is perfect time for me to be playing it's just i don't know a combination of workload plus playing team fortress at weird times of night got me on this schedule in addition, nobody being in the house to wake me up with their shuffling around in the morning, so all those things add up to me being up at really weird times. Here's my gorgeous sidekick, Lydia. Look at her. Look at those lips. She's been hanging out with me for a while now. Um, we've been through thick and thin, so we're kind of bonded. Is that the actual Dovahkiin mask? It's got, the horns are more curled than the one on the commercial, aren't they? We all laughed that we were putting her in the Dovahkiin mask, but it's a little different. Don't you want to just kiss that girl? I know, right? She saved my life, like, how many times? She's almost died for me multiple times. I wish you could um, marry your Jarl sidekick. Same helmet? Huh. Nah, that's a different helmet. So, once again, the chat room is all over the place with what they feel about certain things. I'm going to fast travel to wherever my next main side quest is. What's this? Yeah, ghastly re remains. You can marry her? That's bullshit. I'm calling bullshit on that hardcore. That sure ain't a snar. Alright, I'm gonna, uh... I'm gonna go into the main, the main quest now. So which one is the main quest, guys? Why are so many people saying I can? Not BS, you can in fact- HOW? How do I do it? How? How do I- how do I- Oh, that's it, okay, no main quest. I'm marrying her today. If this is true, guys, I want snarfs on it, and I'm going to go do it. How do I do it? Go to Riften? To do it? The way of the voice? Oh shit, I had no idea. That makes me excited, because I've been totally smitten by her. Riften? Go to Riften, do the amulet. I know that quest. Okay. And then just talk to her? First, you have to stop hitting with fire. <laughs> Step one. Stop scorching your fiancé to be with fire. Alright, so I'm going to go to Whiterun then and get a cab to Riften. Becky won't be jealous. She'll give me a high five. This is like the hottest girl in the game. The amulet gets you married. Do I have to do anything to make step three have her make you a sandwich? Is there anything special to get her to like me then? Because I know that the girl at the Riverwood Trader is really easy. That's what I've been told. And I have been able to marry her on my own with very short amount of playing. But the hottest girl in the game is Hyde D. A lot of people say it's the Huntress that's the hottest girl in the game. We had a lot of long discussion about this have been a while seen ago. In Skyrim. Uh oh. They're an ancient order. I had them figured for dead. <coughs> Alright, so I'm gonna go catch cab. Sexy time with Lydia's coming. Wouldn't wouldn't that have been nice if they'd actually put in sex in the Skyrim? This is an adult game, come on, why not? It should be an adult game. I guess it's not, actually. It's rated... What? Holy crap! It's rated M for mature? What po What in this game means it should be M? What in Skyrim possibly makes this an M-rated game? I can't, I can't even think. I can't think of a single thing. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna get a cab while you guys... Blood and violence? So what? It's not like... There's tons of games with blood and violence. Blood and violence always gets you an M rated? Well, why does, uh... Why does Halo not... Why is Halo not M? For mature. Halo is teen. So explain that one. Beheading makes it M? Aw, oh, man. Well, anyways. If they... You know what? All right. Well, that aside, if you're going to make an M-rated game then, if you're going to have decapitations... What? Halo is M? Alright, whatever. The world is messed up. How many parents get ride? Halo for their you can kids? can take you to any of the hold capitals. Where do you want to go? Alright, um... But, uh... 
But like I was about to say, it's like if you're gonna make a game that is gonna be rated M because of decapitations, put sex in and put some boobs in. You know, like go for broke. I'm not saying put them in where they don't belong. I'm just saying put them in. Like friggin' uh, um, Saints Rose M. Why didn't they just put? Why did they blur out the boobs? It's silly. That would make it an adult only rating because nipples, nipples are adult only. Good lord. What's the difference? Sorry guys, I'm really on a tangent here, but what's the difference between adults only and mature 17 plus? Because isn't 17 plus basically adult? It's the difference between two years of a person being able to play it. Adult only is 18 plus instead of 17 plus, so you're adding one year of maturity to add boobs in, then add boobs in because you're going to sell way more titles. Ah, friggin' world, man. <laughs> My carriage is the safest way to travel. Good day. As if it only adds one one year, and the games haven't been doing it. So, well, didn't Red Dead have nipples in it? Did it become and? Wait a Need second. A I know for a fact that. Uh, I know for a fact that Dante's Inferno has boobs and so does god of war are they adult only god of war has boobs and it got an m there you go so it can't be just because of a couple nipples anyways i gotta get off this <laughs> it's early in the morning and if i wasn't on tangents on the actual show Where do you want i would to be go? just ranting to myself or to the mods on skype that's why this is happening i'm going to rifting Sit baby back and enjoy the ride <laughs> <laughs> Why do I always come in on nipple talk? No, we like your rants, Fraser. All right, good. Explicit sexual content, example, rape, is what makes adults only. Whatever. I, I, I say it's time that we like go all out. Games are for adults. They should be the same as movies. They should sometimes have explicit and adult situations. Things that books that kids are allowed to read have in them. Uh, anybody read Catcher in the Rye? Alright. Uh, it doesn't have rape. But it does have a prostitute. And he almost has sex with her. And then some other things happen. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Where am I? I'm in Riften now. What?! And now a dragon's trying to fight me. Just fucking great. All right, that's it. I'm taking a break. When we come back, more ranting about the rating, uh, the rating um, system for video games in North America, and a fucking dragon. Fucking god. Welcome back to my 2 a.m. Skyrim Christmas Holidays episode of Video Games Lonesome. A dragon has just decided to interrupt my quest to marry my sidekick here, Lydia. I'm kind of in love, so I want to go and get the uh, our, uh, Alara or whatever the amulet is that lets you marry people. But first I gotta defeat this dragon. What do I have equipped first? Firebolts? Sounds good. Let's do this. Where are you going, dragon? Did he run away? Where'd he go? Well, there he is. Hey, buddy. Ah! Come here. So, in our last episode, we went to Winterhold and graduated the college. So now I have that crazy-ass mask on and the robes and some other things they give you, like a uh, little amulet and stuff that makes my magic regeneration go faster. Is this dragon going to run away? If I don't get him? Did he leave? Because I really need an extra dragon soul. Did it? Oh, the chat server's restarting for maintenance. This is what you get for streaming at this time of morning. Looks like the dragon left. Um, Alright, I can't read the chat until I, until I restart or I get you guys back in here. Uh, just a second then. 
I cannot hear you or see you. Should reconnect in a few seconds. I'm probably gonna, you know what? I'm just gonna take a break then. Um, Cause I don't want to do this without you. Uh, so I'm gonna take a break. Be back after this, when the server's up. No, it's up now. There we go. All right. And we're back. You can't marry Lydia without console. What? All right, guys. I want some real information on this then before we continue with the show. I had a million snarfs saying I could marry Lydia. <sighs> Does anybody hear me or can you tell me about Lydia? It's a bug that you can't, so I should be able to marry her. Oh, man. It does not affect everyone. All right. All right, let's... Um, I'm going to take a break here. I'm probably going to cut this out of... This is an extremely boring segment. Off to a great start. I'm going to uh, come back in a bit. Welcome back, everybody. All right, so the chat had me on a red herring quest. You cannot marry Lydia. It says it right on the wiki page, so... Before I let, you uh, let me in. Them, I'm gonna go get the amulet anyways, because I'll marry some girl eventually, so let's do it. The What's the tax? Of entering the city. What does it matter? All right. Keep your voice down. You want everyone to hear you? It's obviously a shakedown. I want in. Just let me <coughs> All right, I know where the temple is, thankfully. I've married Lydia. Huh. I know that people can marry Lydia, guys. Please stop it with this. Uh, I want I want I want the quality of messages in the chat to improve a little bit because it's just me reading it, so it's even harder to sift through what's true and stuff and what seems to be actually knowledgeable at answers there's a chance there is no chance you can marry her it says right on the Never website done. that you need the console I know you you and Riften I had to self snarf it I did some research by myself on the break I'm not afraid of you that's the wrong answer yeah last thing the Blackbriars need around the I don't Black care about anybody me? I'm Maul I watch the streets for him if you need dirt on anything I'm your guy but it'll cost you <coughs> Yeah, I self-snarfed. It was a good snarf. I'll have to self-snarf more often. Uh... <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Just stay out of the Blackbriar's affairs. You'll live I think it's funny. Now. You guys have access to Google. All I had to do was spend one minute on Google and I found the real answer. That's that's not so hard. I'm really getting tired of your Maybe it's that people in here today ha don't watch the show often and don't know what the system is. If you are absolutely sure, you put a snarf next to it. Uh, if you aren't sure, you put a derp. But I don't even think I want derps today. I only want snarfs because in that case, uh, because I, I don't, I, I'm not going to be able to sort through derps. Because um, it's just me. Becky can sort through derps, but I can't. So... And I think derps only make sense on a, a game that's brand new that nobody's ever... I don't know. I don't care. I'm going to take a break again. I'm going to try to clear my thoughts. I'll be back. Welcome back, everybody. All right. I'm going to go get the amulet of Alara or... Oh, shit. I just went into the Mistville Keep. That was an accident. All right. So... Just to remind everybody, snarfs mean that you know absolutely for sure, and I think that I don't even want derps tonight because uh, I don't have anybody to sort through the derps. And even though we only have 400 people in here, the chat's going insanely fast. Everybody oh. seems th to know exactly how to play, but not actually know how to play. <laughs> so, <clears throat> Amulet of Mara. Thank you. Okay. 
here we go. Uh, over here. Is this it? No, that's Skyrim. Maybe I should look at the map in the town here. Where is it? Snowshod Manor, Skyrim, Bunkhouse. Is it even on this map? Check the map. Yeah, I'm checking it. Uh, I do not see it. So I'm going to walk through town until I find it. I thought it was like... Wait, is it over here? I think this is it. Uh, oops, map. Oh, there it is. Good. <coughs> oh, the bee in the barb has the guy who sells it? Alright, so... Um. Oh. Lady Mara, we are devo her Does she tell me about the amulet, though? May I receive her blessings, are infinite you jewel, the light across the land. The across Just tell me what to do. Uh, Mara, throat the of the young village. What? This, I will entreat Mara on your behalf. Oh, okay. What but that had nothing to do with marriage. Mara is the book of love. She if you wish to make a donation to her benevolence, True speak to Mara. Love. Mara is the handmaiden. Does this have anything to do with marriage? The of the storm I'm gonna go to the bee and barb. Don't I have to kick off the quest by talking to her first? Here I go. Going to the B and Barb, anyways. Sure, sure. I'm a dirty beggar. What? Looks like a lot of people are getting pinged off for false snarfing. It's too bad because a lot of people come in here probably just seeing people say snarf. It might be one of their first shows, and they think that they'll just put snarf in front of their sentences to get noticed. Maybe if you people time people out for false snarfing, PM them or something and tell them why. So get out of my the is not mere Sapphire seems... Can you marry Sapphire? One of the signs. The signs eh, she's not as good as Lydia. Who's the guy going to sell it to me? The the this guy? guy? What's his name? Who sells me no, the... No, um, just look at the guy ranting. Kira, uh, certainly we this guy? Blessings of Mara upon you. I want to know Wonderful. more. Mara is the goddess of love. Okay. We who also cares? perform wedding ceremonies for That's all what I'm interested in. in Skyrim. Uh, I could have a wedding at the temple? Yes, if you were ready, of course. I am. Are you familiar with how marriage works in Skyrim? Uh, I might. Typically, Why don't love in Skyrim me? is as earnest as the people. I don't care. A person who is looking for a spouse simply wears an amulet of Mara about Do you have one? Another person shows interest and the two agree to be together. Do you have an amulet? All right, I'll buy an amulet. Thank now, you. Remember, people in Skyrim you done? Enough, to Mara, Mara. We've all, all right. <laughs> more people. He's going to keep on rambling yeah. while I use the amulet. Potion scrolls apparel. Amulet of Mara. Equipped. There's no need to use them as an excuse to harass Hey, Lydia. I've got your back. I know I can't marry you, but I'm going to try anyways. As my thane, I'm sworn to your service. Just keep this oh. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. And I'm thane? What does that mean? The Jarl has wrecked. The title of thane is an honor. <coughs> for your service. Guards will know to look the other way if you tell them who you are. The Jarl has recognized you as a person of great importance in the hold, a hero. Still here. Uh, what else do I want? All right, what is it? I need you enter the commands, issue command to follow reticle. What do Give you that need? command. Can I point at my boobs or 
at my butt. I can't, so I need you to do... What do I need you to do? Nothing. Anything else? No. Um, oh, I like this person who's talking about Jordis the Sword Maiden is a house Carl. Is house Carl that looks like Lydia from Solitude, and is on the list of. What do I have to do to get her? <coughs> so what was it? It was Solitude that I have to go to. Become Thane? How do I become Thane in Solitude? That sounds hard. Still here. Never done an honest day's work in your life for Can you that coin leave you me alone? Hey, lass. No, I don't want to talk to you. You want to make some coin? Come find me. Make love like a saber cat. It's difficult and you need 25,000 gold, don't bother. I only want Lydia. Alright, going back out into Skyrim, I'm going to continue with the main quest now. Now that I have the amulet, maybe I'll marry a girl sometime in the future. It's unfortunate that we started the show off like this when it's not possible to get Lydia, which is the only reason I wanted the amulet for, so... Maybe we'll do a fresh start for the show right after this break. And then uh, we'll go actually play the game. Be back in a while.